Presiding Bishop of Living Faith Church Worldwide, popularly known as Winners Chapel, David Oyedepo, has warned against government interference with churches through the Company and Allied Matters Act, KAMA. President Muhammad Buhari had on August 7 signed KAMA into law. KAMA requires that religious bodies and charity organizations will be strictly regulated by the Registrar General of Corporate Affairs Commission, CAC, and its supervising minister. It also provides that the commission may by order suspend the trustees of an association or a religious body and appoint an interim manager or managers to coordinate its affairs where it reasonably believes that there has been any misconduct or mismanagement or where the affairs of the association have been run fraudulently or where it is necessary or desirable for the purpose of public interest. However, Oyedepo told his congregation on Sunday, August 16, that such laws were made out of jealousy for the church's prosperity. The church works on the pattern delivered by God, not the pattern of man. Government has no power to appoint people over churches. This is a secular nation. The church is the greatest asset of God in this country. Please be warned, judgment is coming. The Lord says, I have been still, but now I will arise. Anybody that is in this deal is taking poison. This will never work. I am waiting for a day when anybody will appoint a trustee over this church. You can't gag anybody. We own this country together, he said. Buari's social media aide, Loretta Onoche, fired back at Oyedepo, saying in a tweet on Monday, August 17, that he would, in that case, have to create his own country. I hope this is not true. If it is, Oyedepo will have to manufacture his own country and live by his own laws. As long as he lives and operates within the entity called Nigeria, he will live by Nigerian rules and laws. He will do as he is told by the law. Enough of lawlessness, she wrote. Thank <music> you.